Welcome back to Kavi OMG. Today we are going to do the pages 21 to 30 of the book Diary of a Wimpy Kid Wrecking Ball. Okay, let's read. I need to get it on the side so I can show you. Hmm, let's see. Okay. Oh, this is where we're going to end. 21. Yes. I'll just read the 20th page real quick, if you want to know. Wait, how do I hold this? Yeah, like this. Now, that's when our first customers started to arrive. I told Ra Rowley we could argue about this later, but now we have to. But for now, we needed to act like professionals. At first, just a few people started to show up. But after a while, a lot more came. And when they started checking out my stuff, I, I went into sales mode. The, the craftsmanship on this porcupine is remarkable. One lady seemed interested in a collector's coin. There. One lady seemed interested in a collector's coin I got from I got from my uncle, but she complained that it was dented. So I thought fast and told her the reason it was dented was because it stopped a bullet in World War Two. This stage now. Okay. She didn't believe it. Wait, I mean, she didn't seem to believe me, though, probably because the coin was dated last year. I spent a lot of time trying to close that deal. And I started worrying about that people were stealing behind my back. Unfortunately, my theft prevention manager um, was totally uh, useless because he was busy playing with the ma magnet set. Mm. That seems a little not theft prevention manager. Okay, now I'm going to do this. I guess I could just do this. I could just put my knee up here. Or maybe I can back this up. There. Okay, that's okay. I told Raleigh he'd better start doing his job or he was going to get fired. I don't think you could get fired. In, like, a non-real job, though. But Raleigh said it wasn't a real job anyway because he wasn't getting paid. I explained that I hadn't sold anything yet and didn't have any money to pay him with. with. So when he said he was leaving, I told him he could pick out one item from any table and that could be his payment. Brawley seemed pretty excited about that the that idea and I thought he sh for sure he's he'd choose the magnet set but instead he, he had but the, he headed straight for the rare items table instead. Ooh, very, very. That was too easy. I explained that those things were only for paying customers 
and that maybe he'd be interested in something from the fun toys table, but Riley wouldn't budge. Eventually, he settled on the vampire bat shield. Wait, I don't think you can see that. Yep, yeah, there, vampire bat shield. Eventually, or I mean, and I was okay with that because it was really just a broken umbrella with, but now Riley was so worried about bats that he couldn't concentrate on his job. This one. While Riley was fooling around with his stupid umbrella, I thought I saw a guy take an action figure from the collectibles table and from the collectibles and stuff it in his pocket. So I ran over to deal with him. To deal with him. Yes. Good. We are going to go to page 24. Wow, this is going to take longer than I thought. I'll try to make it. Okay, there. I'll be like this thing. But the only things in the guy's pockets were some used tissues. I mean, were some used tissues and car keys. I was glad I was staying alert, though, because I headed off headed off a major disaster. A pickup truck pulled aside. Uh, aside, alongside the curb and some guy from Gorley Street started piling my stuff into the back. I asked what the what he was doing and he said that since tomorrow was trash day he thought the stuff by the curb was for grabs but I didn't have any time to explain the concept of a yard sale to this big guy because all of a sudden, uh, mm, all of a sudden, I had an even bigger problem to deal with. It started to rain, and everyone was heading back to their cars. I was worried I might never get this many people to come to your tail again and I wanted to sell something to make all the effort worth it. So I went around and marked down the prices on every item. Twenty five's done. Halfway through Then it started really, really raining. Then it started really raining. Yes. Then it started really raining. I knew I was going to have to do something drastic. I threw a bunch of stuff into boxes and offered even bigger, bigger discounts. But by then... It was too late anyway. I knew that if I didn't get my stuff inside, it was all gonna get 
ruined. So I asked Rally to keep his umbrella over my most valuable items while I ran everything else in to the garage. But Rally wasn't any help at all. He said his sh his shift had just ended and it was time for him to go home. So I was on my own now. Own. I was on my own. I tried carrying a box of comic books into the garage, but by now the box was soggy and the bottom gave out. Ooh, 27. Three more pages. Ooh. It took uh, it took me about a hundred trips to get everything into the garage, but I probably shouldn't have even bothered because most of my stuff was already ruined. I figured I could still make one sale, though. I told Mom that the flower was all hers for three bucks. Unfortunately, by then she changed her mind. Wednesday. I actually, I'm actually kind of glad nobody bought anything from my yard sale the other day because. If I ever get famous, that stuff is going to be worth a lot more money than I was asking for. I'd feel pretty dumb if I sold one of my old homework assignments for 50 cents and then someone auctioned it off later, auctioned it off later on for a few thousand dollars. S sold to the gentleman in the striped tie. One day, they'll probably make my childhood home, childhood home into one of those places schools visit on field trips. This is la last page. It's this one. This one. Okay. And if that happens, they're going to, wait, if that happens, they're going to want all the authentic stuff I owned growing up. <clears throat> Sorry. The reason I'm not already famous is because when you're a kid, they keep you busy with s school and homework. So there's not a lot of time left over to make a name for yourself. But one of but one of the ways kids a kid can actually get famous is by becoming a hero. My parents watch the news every night and there's always a kid about uh, a story about a kid saving someone from choking or something like that. This is so, guys, I finished the 30 pages I mean, 10 pages and I actually hope you like it. I like it, and I just noticed there's a sticker on the wall. Put on my thing. Well, guys, if you want to see my thing, it's my cardboard thing. I just wrote Kavya OMG here. And I could write everything. I already put something in chalk. When I was doing the slime challenge with my sister, I put slime challenge here. You couldn't see it though. I think I should put it like right here though. But yeah. So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, smash that like button and I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.